Today is January 1st, 2021. My name is Caitlin Mason and I love my life. About a month ago, I woke up and I realized that I was not depressed anymore. And we as young people, specifically millennials, throw around that D word a lot, depressed. And I used to say, oh, I'm so depressed. Or, oh, I can't go out, I'm so depressed. Or, oh, I'm broke, <laughs> I'm so depressed. But we joke about it until we're outside of depression and we realize that I'm not depressed anymore, what the hell? So I'm using this platform to document my life a year post-depression. So in the past year, 2020 took a lot from a lot of us. Aside from COVID, um, I started the year uh, unemployed. I lost my job. Um, I lost my friends. Most significantly, I lost my grandmother, which broke my heart. Um, but in all of that, I found myself. I found my tribe. I found things that I genuinely love, people that genuinely love me. So moving forward this year, I am committed to myself and committed to the things that I love and committed to the things that love me, which is why we are here at the Salamander Resort and Spa. Um, the man that I'm dating and I love this place because one, it's owned by a black woman. Two, the details is what makes the place. And that's another D word that's aligned with our original D word, depression. It's not always one major thing that triggers to chronic depression. But in my experience, I've noticed that, like the show, it's a million little things and the details of those little things that can contribute to a five year stretch of depression. So I could get into why I was depressed and what I did while I was depressed, but I'm committed to myself and I'm committed to my journey and I'm committed to my loves. Um, and I'm committed to reminding myself that I love my life and that it's okay to love my life and that it's okay to live in luxury and show it off and embrace it because those are the things that, and the details that make life a little easier. So last night was New Year's Eve and I spent it with my love here at the Salamander Resort and Spa. Um, but unfortunately he had to go to work, but fortunately for me and my journey and commitment to myself, this is a time for me to love my life. Um, I'm an only child and my father's always told me I was brought into this old world alone. And I used to get sad about that. However, um, alone and being alone is such a beautiful thing. Um, and it's such a powerful thing, especially when you learn to embrace it. Um, so I will be documenting my journeys alone and time spent alone and the good and the bad and the ugly and the in-between um, so that a year from today, I can look back um, regardless of whatever this year may bring me and remind myself that out of the 365 days that may be hard or intense or mall just simply is coming to tap you on the shoulder that there was one day, at least one day, that I know that I loved my life. So I hope you enjoy. Thank you.